Hello there ladies and gentlemen, how are you doing? Joe Barnes here. Now this is a quick video because there's been a recent change at Facebook you may or may not have noticed. Um, if you are looking at this page and you're thinking I have no idea what's in front of me, then you probably need to go and watch some of my other training um, over at the Social Networking Academy which tells you how to create an app. Um, this video really is for people who are already creating their own apps but may have noticed that the ad profile page has gone missing. So for instance, I'm in an app at the moment, if I click on edit settings, then you can see here there's this view app profile page. Yeah, so we know that we can go and create an app and then click on view app profile page and we can then add that application to our Facebook page. That little button there has disappeared on new apps. If I go back to a test app I created and go into edit settings, you'll notice there is no longer a view app profile page. So if you're creating your own page tabs and are loading them onto Facebook and all of a sudden this has disappeared, you may be thinking, well, how on earth do I now add my tab to my page? And that's what I'm going to show you over the next couple of minutes. So let's go through it step by step. Let's go to create new app and then I'm going to call this test. 225 and then I'm going to call the app namespace Joe test 100 I know they don't match but there we go and then I'm going to click I agree to the Facebook platform policies and continue goodness me I have absolutely no idea what that says let's try another text H Y 5 K X F I think that says oh I'm not even typing it in there sorry H Y, 5, K, X, F. Gosh, I dislike captures. Okay, great. That's created this app. Fantastic. So this is my test app. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to scroll to the bottom and I'm going to click on page tab. I want to build a custom tab for Facebook pages. And as I would do normally, I'm going to put in all the information that's required to create a page tab. So this is a very badly designed web page that I'm going to add to my page. Uh, it's something I used as an example recently, so ignore the design. What we want though is the URL. Okay, so I'm going to go and grab this URL and copy that. Go back over here and I'm going to put that in the page tab URL. And then of course I need to put in a secure page tab URL now. And I do have an SSL certificate, so that's going to work fine. So that's HTTPS. And then I'm just going to call this test 225, okay, as my page tab name. And then click save changes. Very important that you've got all of your information in there correctly. OK. All right. So the changes have been saved. Now what we need to do is grab your app ID. We need this for the next step. So you want to copy this app ID that's here. OK. And then underneath this video, I'm going to place a piece of code which you need to copy and place in your browser address bar. So if we go to my text edit file, let me just delete that app ID. OK. I'm going to place the one that I've just copied there. But what I'm now going to do is I'm going to go and grab this piece of code here that I'm going to put underneath this video for you. Open a new tab on my browser. Put in that URL that I'm going to give you. OK. And then I'm going to grab my app ID. Very important. We need this now. And I'm going to replace this section here that says your app ID replace that with the actual ID number and then just click return. That is now going to bring up this little um, button here that says add page tab. If we click under choose Facebook pages and if I go down here to say the finding love over 40 page that I created as an example and then click add page tab. Okay that's then just going to take me back here so let's go and find that page finding love over 40 there we go. And if I go down here on the left hand side, there's my test 225. If I click on that, then that is actually going to bring up my page. Now, the chances are it probably took me back to the wall because this is an unpublished page. If you've got a published page, it will probably, when you click return there, take you straight to your page and show you your tab. But that's basically how you do it. It's actually really quite simple and easy. Um, so just back to this page here, you just simply put in all the information as you would any normal application, 
grab the app ID, place the URL that I'm going to put underneath this video into your browser address bar, add in the ID where it says your app ID. You just hover over that and replace that with the actual app ID, click return, follow the on-screen instructions and boom, your tab is added to your page. All right, I hope that's helped. If you've got any queries or questions, don't hesitate to come over to the Social Networking Academy fan page and ask us. We're on there all day, every day to help you out. Other than that, um, you have a fantastic Christmas and I'll speak to you very soon. Take care. Bye-bye.